What's going on guys? Cody from Southeast Softwash and today we're bringing you a skunk edition build. So this is a one-off trailer. Uh, you can't order this, okay, but you can purchase it. This trailer is going to be available for purchase. Let's walk through it real quick. It is a one-off. We're sort of getting into, my plan is to at least every other month roll out something that's just different, a little bit crazy. We're going to do an enclosed trailer probably in the next month or two and it'll be kind of something different as well. But this trailer is, as you can see, not our normal trailer, but it's built for degreasing. So I still got a few things left to do. I'm gonna put some straps on this tank here. But uh, other than that, it's about ready to go. We finished it just a few minutes ago. And this is built for the customer who's gonna go and do gas stations, dumpster pads, just basically a ton of degreasing jobs. Now, you could house wash off of this. We've got a 30 gallon chemical tank here. Currently, that's loaded up with dynamite degreaser because the purpose of this thing, like I said, is to do uh, degreasing jobs. And I like the fact that it's compact. Before somebody asks, yes, the axle is big enough. We, ain't, we know what we're doing. We, we did the mass here. So we've got a hot water system, a 200 gallon water tank, a 30 gallon chemical tank up front, which is currently full of degreaser. So downstream and degreaser, cleaning anything greasy and oily. This is gonna be a beast. And I like the fact that it's not a massive trailer. So you can kind of get in and out of some of these smaller compact areas. If somebody out there is doing that kind of work, this would be a killer little rig for you. We've got the skunk logo on this side. We've got a uh, Southeast logo on the other side. So 30 gallon chem capacity. We've got an 18 inch reel here. This would be your feed side on the driver's side of the, uh, the trailer. So we've got 200 foot of feed. You can put another uh, chunk of feed hose on there, but this is one of our 18 inch real big deals, all three quarter plumbing. Uh, we've got another real big deal on the other side and this is going to be your discharge side so we've got uh, 300 feet of high pressure hose 18 inch real big deal here we've also got our smart stream so this is our remote control remote control downstream injector remote is in the box this is really really cool for what it's trying to do uh, degreasing you can do that remotely and go back and forth between rinse and chemical um, moving back we do got a little wand storage area here the, the wand will lock into this pipe and we've got a hot water system now this is a unique system here it's a be we painted it black these come yellow they started to make these in black i think they look better black so we we put a little bit of a uh, high temperature paint on here just because I, I don't like the big bright yellow at least not on this trailer it just didn't go with the the feng shui but diesel powered gas in the uh, the gas tank diesel in the diesel tank right but it's not an eight gallon a minute this is a honda 690 belt drive but this is actually like a seven gallon a minute pump. It's a unique pump. And what that means is you're gonna get even hotter water because the burner is still set up for an eight gallon. So this is a BE unit, full warranty. It's just a different pump that's on there. Can you really tell the difference between a seven and an eight? Not really, it's, uh, it's basically the same output, but you will get slightly even hotter hot water than, uh, than is standard on these units. And we really like these. We use these on all of our big trailer builds. Uh, we do have outriggers here on the back, so if you're uh, disconnected from the truck, you want to make sure that you lower those down so that it doesn't tilt because it's got a lot of weight on the back. Now, if you've got your water tank, even if you've got, you know, 50 gallons of water in the water tank, it's pretty much balanced. But just in case a guy has an empty water tank and he needs to disconnect from the truck, he just drops the outriggers and it'll sit there. So we're going to go and do a little bit of footage with this trailer. Going to go clean a Burger King. We've got some really bad uh, food grease out back on the sidewalk area. But again, this trailer is going to be for sale. So let's go get some footage, a little bit of content, and uh, you guys can come along for the ride. If you want to grab this, it's a one-off. It's a one of it, one of its kind, Skunk Edition build. Uh, we're pretty proud of that. So we're going to do some weird stuff. This is sort of the first of the different, you know, we want to build something different every once in a while. So there you go. If anybody wants to grab it, uh, price and links will be down in the description. I'm going to get rid of this thing uh, pretty cheap. I'm not going to try to mark it up really high. I don't want it sitting around the shop too long. But if one of you guys out there does a lot of degreasing, dumpster pads, gas stations, uh, any of that kind of stuff where you're just basically doing a ton of grease jobs, this will be a killer for that. All right, let's go get some footage.